what, what the mate is talking about. Yeah. What's up, family? This is an old story, but it's new to me. Plus, I find it absurd enough to share with you. We have a Florida man who claims that his dog shot his sleeping girlfriend. Yeah. The incident happened in the Jacksonville home of Brian Murphy and Summer Miracle, his girlfriend. Murphy told authorities that the dog, Diesel, woke him up so he decided to take the pooch out for a little bit. According to ABC News, as Diesel and Murphy walked back into the home, the dog ran into the dark bedroom where Miracle was sleeping. Murphy said that he saw a flash and heard a loud bang right after he went into the bedroom and realized his girlfriend had been shot. Miracle was shot in the leg, but told police she doesn't know what happened because she was sleeping and awoke to a throbbing pain in her leg. Murphy said he covered Miracle's leg with a towel and called 911 to report the shooting. Miracle was taken to the hospital for non-life-threatening injuries and has since made a full recovery. Still no word on whether or not this gun-busting dog is going to be charged. Wouldn't that be something if they went to the house and put the cuffs on the dog, put him in the back seat? Took him on a ride, booked him into the jail, put him in a cell, and he had a celly, and they was talking to each other, like human dog talk. <laughs> Man, y'all know this is crazy. Y'all know that didn't happen like he said it happened. He probably was going for the kill, and it didn't work out when he shot in the leg. He's like, nah, that ain't going to work. I'm going to make it seem like she killed herself. It's got to be one shot to the head. Shot in the leg accidentally. Of course, she wakes up. She's disoriented. And she has to go with the story that he comes up with because, of course, she can't imagine that the guy that she's laying her head next to every night is thinking about killing her, wants her dead. This stuff happens all the time. I say pay very, very close attention to this couple uh, because... Anything could happen. Mostly when people want their spouses dead and they try and they fail, they try again and again. So we'll see how that works out. Dogs chew homework. They eat homework. They don't shoot guns, man. If their, gun, if their dog shot the gun, then my cat was on the grassy knoll. You know what I'm talking about? The grassy knoll? Kennedy? That's crazy, man. The closest thing that I could think of that comes to that is when I was out hunting once with my boy Reggie. And my rifle fell to the ground and let off a round. Scared the hell out of me, man. I was gone. That was crazy. I'm talking about a boom, big old blast. I thought I was out of here. But that does happen. Now, he said that the dog ran into the bedroom, jumped on top of the nightstand, and the gun fell and shot her in the leg. The gun fell. If she's in the bed asleep, she's sleeping. And the gun falls to the floor. Her leg must have been hanging off the bed. It's wild out here, man. You got to watch your back. It's a miracle that she didn't get killed. The husband, I'm not buying it. I'm not buying it. If it's not the husband, then who? I mean, there's nothing more dangerous than a pistol-packing pit bull. 
That's wild. I mean, just the thought of that. That's why I'm going with the husband. I think the husband tried to kill her. Because if you believe that that dog shot that woman, your mama should be embarrassed and your daddy should have pulled out. No more talk. What, what the maid is talking about. Damn. Order, Texas.